The force of gravity keeps you standing on the ground by giving you weight, but it also keeps air close to the ground as well. Just in the same way our feet press down on the ground when we are standing up, air presses its weight down on the ground too. This is what we call air pressure. We cannot feel air pressure because our bodies are naturally able to cope with the weight of the air above us. In fact, air is so light that it takes about 800 bottles of air to weigh as much as just one bottle of water. We are able to measure the air pressure using a barometer, which looks like this. The barometer displays the pressure on a screen to show where the pressure is high, low or changing. Sometimes, there is more air pressing down on the ground. This is called high pressure. High pressure is caused by air sinking and being squashed together. When air is rising, we get low pressure and so less air is pressing down on the ground. Air moves from being squashed under areas of high pressure to areas of low pressure where it is less squashed. This movement of air from high to low pressure creates wind. In the UK, if there is high air pressure during the summer months, then we usually get hot and sunny days. Ideal for trips to the seaside. High air pressure in the winter though means cold weather and normally a frost in the mornings, so we need to wear warm clothes. If there is low pressure, then it's normally cloudy, wet and windy. So it's a good time to put on a raincoat and wear your wellies.